Have you ever stood up during a work call only to realize too late that you forgot to wear pants? Yeah, <laughs> me neither. But apparently it's a common thing everywhere from news anchors to our elected representatives in Congress. According to one survey, over 14% of men and 5% of women practice pantsless video conferencing. I feel like this is missing a category. So I made a video filter for the 10% of you who can't be bothered to put on pants. The default version just blurs out everything below the belt, but you can also draw on pants to look more professional. It works by tracking specific body landmarks using a machine learning toolkit called MediaPipe. I most recently used MediaPipe to make a face-controlled keyboard, which I thought was kind of awkward to test in public, but it turns out working on a pants filter is a lot worse. So for testing, I used the sides of my mouth and gave myself a pants mustache. But once I moved back down to the hips, I found out that posture tracking isn't that great unless most of your body is showing. So as an extra precaution, if your head leaves the top of the frame, it just assumes there's a possible unsafe for work region below. You can customize the width for better coverage. You can also hit the P key to change your pants if you want to better coordinate an outfit. Although let's be honest, if you forgot to put on pants, you probably forgot to configure your virtual pants for the day. The easiest way to use the output in another program like Zoom is to download OBS, open it up and click start virtual camera. Then with the pants filter running, just select your new camera output. It also works on recordings so we can finally right the wrongs of the past. I've found that a lot of music videos are greatly improved by some pants, but be careful, the pants only go straight down. So if you're caught twerking or doing handstands or whatever, they might not align properly. I also discovered that pants are three-dimensional, so it works great facing forward or back, but if you turn to the side, it's less than ideal. It's been a while since my last video. I wrote half this project using my face, so it took a while. If you want to encourage this madness, please subscribe. And if you want to try on your own pants, the code is linked below.